Hello, and welcome everyone. My name is J.R. Campbell. I'm one of the crash trainers with TechStat. In this 3-5 to five minute comparison video, I'll be discussing the tools and features within a new diagramming tool, Easy Street Draw Web. Easy Street Draw Web is currently available at an agency's discretion within Configure. Let's begin. This version contains the following tools. The file menu found within Easy Street Draw ActiveX does not appear within Easy Street Draw Web. Instead, it is integrated with the toolbar in the following manner. Save and continue editing. Close and keep unsaved changes. Close and discard unsaved changes. At a quick glance, the shortcut icon appears to be the same as Easy Street Draw ActiveX. However, Easy Street Draw Web is reconfigured for a more space saving integration in the following format your pencil drop down, which includes your labeling, as well as other custom shapes for diagramming, your ability to import images your increase and decrease of font sizes, your zoom in and zoom out, as well as a trash can to discard your current diagram and start over. Easy Street Draw Web is preloaded with three templates accessible via a hyperlink located center screen precisely like Easy Street Draw ActiveX. Intersection, Curve, and Interchange. While Easy Street Draw Web includes only two layers, your street layer and symbols layer, its counterpart Easy Street Draw ActiveX includes three. But just like Easy Street Draw ActiveX, it also includes sublayers. Within your streets, you have your streets, lanes and shoulders, stripes, lane markers, indicator arrows, and labels. Let's go ahead and begin and create a simple four-way diagram with two vehicles. Simply go out to your right hand side, select your first object, Drag to the center, let go. When you have an object that's active, it'll have these green ant lines as well as multiple handles. Simply hover over one of the handles, stretch, and create your diagram. The additional handles, also included, allows you to increase your turn bay on the fly. To access the property bar for this object, simply double click. It will display above. You will have your lane count, your travel lane width, and your ability to add dividers. You will also have the text box to label. Once completed, hit the X top right. Now, to create our intersection, simply go back out to your right hand side, select your object, and drag and release it will automatically snap and create your intersection. Same handles are available as previously. Same way to access your property bar as well. Simple double click. Now, let's go ahead and add our vehicles. Simply go to your symbols layer, and just like Easy Street Draw ActiveX, it contains a search. But let's go ahead and go within our vehicles and select two units. Rotation tool is available at the hood. To access its property bar, double click. At this time, we have completed our diagram. Thank you for watching our comparison video. If you have any questions or future enhancements requests, please feel free to contact our crash support team via email or by phone.